The chair of the Standing Committee on Finance, Yunus Karim, says there is no change in the plan to conduct hearings on the Steinhoff scandal at the end of January. Karim refutes the idea that the hearings are being held at the request of DA Shadow Minister for Finance, David Maynir. Karim says he acted immediately on the Steinhoff matter by writing to the Financial Services Board to establish the terms of reference. The hearings will be attended by members of the Standing Committee on Public Accounts. It is scheduled for the 30th and the 31st of January. In December, the company admitted to accounting irregularities. CEO Marcus Uesta resigned after Steinhoff admitted it would withdraw its 2015 and 2016 financials. Steinhoff had not yet stipulated what the irregularities were that led to the auditor Deloitte refusing to sign off its 2017 financials. There are regulatory and other bodies that have been established by law, as Mr. Gordy will confirm, including the Financial Services Board, the Independent Regulatory Board for Auditors, we also have the Reserve Bank and so on, whose job it is to investigate these matters. We passed these laws post-1994. Our job as committees, I'm sure Mr. Gordy will agree, is to hold those regulatory and other statutory bodies to account for what they have done since the matter broke out in the public domain in the first instance. That's our priority. Secondly, we have, as Mr. Gordy and I will inform you, already written to all of them and gave them seven days within which to reply. And in fact, they've done so, explaining that they're conferring amongst themselves and also with the regulatory and other statutory bodies in Germany and I think the Netherlands. And all of this information was given to at least the Finance Committee, since all these bodies account to the Finance Committee, uh, by the 22nd of December. So obviously it's absurd. Uh, and just completely disingenuous, to put it mildly, for Mr. Mania to claim that he prompted this inquiry. Standing Committee on Public Accounts Chairperson Temba Gotti joins us live over the phone line. A very good afternoon to you, sir. Thank you so much for joining us here on and 7 Now, what do you make of uh, the chair of the Standing Committee Finance, Yunus Karim, saying uh, that the hearings are not being held at the request of DA Shadow Minister of Finance, David Mainir? No, that's very correct. Um, uh, you know, at the risk of politicking about these matters, but uh, I think the DA has established a record for itself for being, uh, you know, just being what it is. Um, I think it's sheer nonsense to want to suggest that we act at the behest of the DA uh, when this uh, corruption scandal that Stainhoff broke out. Uh, we, in the Standing Committee on Public Accounts, uh, issued a statement indicating that uh, uh, this worst corruption scandal in the history of our country um, cannot be spectated by Parliament, that uh, we believe ourselves and, of course, our comrades in the Finance Committee uh, have an obligation and responsibility uh, to get close to the matter, to understand what has happened since there are billions of public funds that are concerned. So what we did yesterday was to finally agree that uh, we are not going to have separate engagements, but rather that um, the two committees plus that one of public service and administration uh, are going to hold these uh, hearings jointly. So no way is uh, the DA uh, involved, and to suggest otherwise, I think that's being nonsensical, frankly. So what can we expect then to happen? When can we expect these joint hearings to actually start taking place so that this matter of Steinhoff can come to a close or that there can be some clarity for the public on the Steinhoff matter? Well, late yesterday I confirmed uh, to uh, Comrade uh, Yunus that uh, the date that uh, is open for us as COPA is the 31st of January, uh, with which he had earlier indicated he had no problem. Uh, so I would want to believe that uh, we have firmed up the 31st of January as the date uh, on which this hearing is going to take place. Well, thank you so much uh, for joining us on the phone line. Of course, that was Temba Gadi. He is the uh, Standing Committee on Public Accounts uh, Chairperson. Joining us over the phone line and just uh, giving us some clarity as to what will happen. He said that yesterday there was agreed that there will be a joint hearing with all three of the committees involved in the Steinhoff matter. And also saying that they do expect these hearings to happen on the 31st of January this year.